Hello everyone, it's Kim here from Kim's Creative Corner and I'm really late getting this video started today but hopefully the lighting won't be too bad. I've got two odd lights on but it's almost dark outside so it may not be the best quality but I wanted to try and get something out to you um, tonight because I'm going to be away for a few days so here we go. I have no idea what I'm doing but I've had a few um, comments and requests about wanting to hear more about my thought process when I'm art journaling and um, I'm going to try and do that and I'm going to try to speak more clearly than I usually do on videos. I usually tend to babble and um, I don't speak very loud in general so this will be a bit of a struggle for me probably, but um, I will do my best. So I think I'm going to continue with this spread because I kind of I kind of like the colors and um, I did a journal flip the other day and realized that I had quite a few unfinished spreads or partially started or partially completed, however you want to say. The glass is half empty or half full. Okay, so um, I'm going to try and stick with my five again. So for texture, I'm uh, going to go in with some coarse molding paste from Golden. I got a little sample jar here that I've used a little bit of and uh, it's fun to play with actually gives the page a really cool texture so I'm going to use this with some stencils probably let me give this some more thought this dry for about an hour and I really like the way it's the color of the um, dilutions sprays that I used underneath is coming through. Well, that's hard to get on camera this late in the day but I got a pretty good idea. It's cool. So I'm going to add some more texture, this time with some glass bead gel. how cool this looks. The way the, um, the Illusions ink sprays are coming up through the glass bead gel is just cool. Can you see? Well, I'm sure you can. Um, you can see the lines of the stencils. They come, it goes right through the uh, heart. It's not dry yet. I've been heat gunning it for the last 10 or 15 minutes and it's still quite wet. But as you can see it will dry clear. See that one is about half dry and then this one is almost completely dry and just <laughs> it looks so cool. So I'm 
still trying to get these to dry. They're, this one's totally dry, I believe. I just think it's so cool the way the dilution sprays have seeped up through and they've almost become neon. I started this on Friday. It's now Sunday. Um, I spent the day yesterday with the fabulous Joanne Sharp, um, taking her a uh, couple of her um, in-person courses. It was amazing. Um, got to meet a lot of amazing, ca talented, creative women, and I'm totally inspired to um, finish this page for you today. So. Um, got a couple of ideas, but I'm not really sure exactly. I really like the page the way it is right now. I'm reluctant to add anything to it, but it just doesn't feel done. So, I think perhaps I'm going to um, get my stencils out again and maybe some paint and see what happens. Thank you. 